Hey, what up, bro? It's AP Ra here. Yo, man, this is an update to my first video about the Dr. Disrespect situation where he cheated on his wife with a minor. Surprisingly, I don't know if I'm just getting like a bad audience from YouTube. Yeah, that video has all dislikes. Like right now, it's I'm going 0 and 6 for YouTube likes when it comes to my Dr. Disrespect video. I didn't have an outrageous take on it. I just said it's wrong for a 40 year old man to leave his wife and kid to talk to a minor and that yeah that's what everybody else had the opinion of this video is just me debunking takes that east loves had on twitter but before i start i find it very interesting i don't know why i got the guys in my comments literally defending a pedophile because i had a guy have like a mental breakdown in my comments when i made uh, my original dr disrespect video he said yo are a fucking idiot quit saying a kid or child she was 17 when did the doc say he knew that she was a minor makes no fucking sense he said it in his original statement he he knew that this was a bad thing. Doesn't matter how old she is. 17, three months, turning 18 in two weeks. He knows as a man that's that's morally wrong. Everybody should have a moral compass. Even if she was 18, still, that's still weird. If she just turned 18 yesterday. Who's your new boyfriend, sweetie? Oh, this 40 year old guy I met online who has a wife and a kid. Strange as fuck. You don't think that's strange? It sounds weird when I put it that way, doesn't it? I think morally, the only time that defense should be used for 18-year-old, 19-year-old people, not, you know, 40-year-olds. Because there's a surprisingly large amount of people who think that he's in the right. First on the chopping block, we got Jean Francois Gipoli. What, dude, what the hell? What is that name? Help me. Ah, I see a 17 year old consenting to sexual conversation. He could have in cement. What the hell is that word? In cemented meaning. What the fuck? It means to put a male animal sperm into a female animal. What the fuck are you talking about? What the fuck? I've never heard anybody in my entire life describe sex like that. That's the creepiest way I've ever heard anybody describe sex he said in cemented as in a male animal making this connection uh of a 40 year old man saying it would be perfectly fine for him to leave his daughter and his wife to in cement a 17 year old girl 21 and up is done no what the hell like like the more you go up the more time you should probably spend in prison <laughs> and then at the, at the end he's like unfortunately he just sexted her should have kept it going what Bro, that's some nasty ass shit, dude. What? You're, bro, you're fantasizing about another guy doing, you know, to an underage girl? And j judging by your profile, you don't, you don't look like the age to be saying something like that. You look way too old. This guy's about 40 years old too. Um, oh no. <laughs> oh no. What, what did I just, what did I just walk into? The first thing you see when you look this guy's name up is alt-right YouTuber accused of, of luring. No, this isn't funny. Of accused of luring an autistic teen in pregnancy plot. He makes white nationalist videos accused of trying to impregnate an autistic teen while he was married to another woman. This guy has some first-hand experience. I'm just gonna move on. That was unscripted. I just found that and I think I want to move on. Um, yeah, next guy, uh, Chud Something, something, Chud. I'll call you, I, I call you Chud. It's basically a, a meme of Dr. Disrespect being portrayed as the tall Chad talking to a 17 year old penis height. Of course he draws the girl like really short. Oh, what if she was 17 years old, 365 day old child? And then his wife saying, she's literally a child. Like, oh yeah, her, uh, his wife is fucked up for being mad. On her uh, t-shirt, they drew nagging wife. Yeah, cheating on your wife with a minor. Totally normal. She nags too much. Gotta cheat on you with a minor. Where's his kid at in the picture? Of course, they don't want to bring that up. It doesn't fit the narrative. Twitch saying, you, 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 you can't do this. Dude, they got Dr. Disrespect portrayed as, as like some Batman character. Hey, sweetheart. Let's get out of here. Dude, that's fucking disgusting. And the comments are agreeing with it. What? What is society coming to? This, this is fucking weird, bro. What What is going on? Next up, we got Sneeko. You know what's funny? To some degree, I actually like respect Sneeko. I think he's doing like the Andrew Tate method where he says a lot of like tame stuff that's common sense and everybody should agree with. And then once he ropes you in and makes you follow him, he says some like 
crazy shit like right here if uh he said if you're 13 years old edging to pokemon all day it's okay but if doctor disrespects text a girl who's 17 11 months 364 days 59 minutes 59 seconds he's the worst person ever again i'm not i'm not gonna repeat myself 40 year old man with a wife and kids that's not you can't do that. I don't know where these guys are getting the the girl is 17 turning 18 tomorrow. So it doesn't matter. Even if she was hypothetically, when he talked to her, she was turning 18 in two weeks. You're, you're still talking to a minor. Doesn't matter. Uh, you're still cheating on your wife who you had a kid with. Knowing this is bad. That's why you never came out with it. Should he really set an example? like that he has a daughter so when she turns 17 do you think that he would let her talk to a 40 year old man married exactly like him do you think he would let that situation slide a lot of this has to do with morals moving on from sneeko we all know this guy has weird takes regardless he said that cuties uh the controversial movie that came out a couple years ago was perfectly fine i get that yeah he always oh, yeah sometimes he's a, a free speaker it's a it's a hit or miss sometimes bro the quartering Next up is the quarter and he had a absolute breakdown. This is after Dr. Disrespect came out and said, hey, I admit to talking inappropriately with a minor. This guy comes out and says, there is zero evidence that Dr. Disrespect is a pedophile. Chatting in any way, kind of inappropriate way with a minor is not okay, obviously, but words have meaning. The left, of course, of course. It's 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 the quarter and the left is pushing the pedo jacket in retaliation for nick Merckx calling out their grooming it's super clear bro what do you really think the left is saying dr disrespect is bad just because nick Merckx had controversial lgbtq takes on twitter really seriously so so they so they planned this all out i can't believe they forced dr disrespect to text that minor four years ago just to retaliate against nick Merckx today unbelievable conspiracy theorist he's a big fan that's why he's coping very hard on twitter he made a video a couple hours ago said that people misunderstood him on twitter and said he thinks it's bad for dr disrespect to text anybody other than his wife and to text anybody outside of his age group to a lot of people him messaging anybody other than his wife is not okay and i think that that's very fair to say him carrying on conversations with anybody who isn't in his age bracket also not okay then right after he said that it's not that big of a deal people are taking this way too out of context people are acting like he's texting five-year-olds the internet has already jacketed him you know placed a label on him people are treating him as if he were caught red-handed with like you know <clears throat> somebody who's like seven or something like that and thanks to that position i'm getting you know hundreds or thousands of dislikes on videos in which all i want people to do is give them the benefit of the doubt dude you just you just contradicted yourself what are you talking about right after that he's like oh i'm a big fan i used to be a big fan back in the day Day one fan. Uh, people who call themselves part of the Champions Club, like I have for years now, since day one on YouTube streaming. Um, you know, you just kind of hope that it isn't as bad as people say. Bro, come on, man. Put away your red vest and mustache, glasses. It's over, bro. He admitted it. There's nothing else to prove. He said specifically that he had conversations with a minor as a 40-year-old man, wife and kids included, that tended to get a little bit inappropriate you would have to go through every single one of his messages which are gone by now for you to have a conclusion when i can just read this guy admitted it and yet yeah, that's basically it like i said before dr disrespect knows he messed up he never came out and said it's not really my fault i kind of didn't do anything that bad he did admit it with those one or two sentences regardless of if he said nothing illegal was exchanged and it was settled still morally regardless of law morally that's what people are targeting that's why people are upset i'm very surprised that dr disrespect was able to be in a position where he was hiding this fact for four years i just started this commentary channel just about a week ago so i'm really hoping to grow fast i'm trying to do a video like once a day hopefully that's the goal uh so thank you bye